I stand on stage with two gentlemen, one who does good work in his neighborhood, somebody I would refer to as the outsider. The other gentleman has been around for 35 years. I think it's safe to call him the insider. And I stand before you as the outsider on the inside. I have an acute sensitivity for how things are and how they should be. And I have a significant track record working within City Hall to identify problems and to come up with solutions. So I offer myself as the outsider on the inside. Tonight you have a choice to make. Mr. O'Grady offers a symbolic gesture of cutting his salary in half. It would be meaningful if there were 3,500 council members willing to join him in that gesture, but there aren't. And Mr. LeBond stands before you and asks for four more years so that he can take that truck and fix our streets. Again, a gesture that would be meaningful if we had 3,500 years to fix our streets, but we don't. So I stand before you crystal clear on the fact that the city of LA is in the midst of a crisis of leadership and we're experiencing a sense of urgency. Imagine the Titanic heading toward the iceberg. Mr. O'Grady would run to the to the bridge and cut the captain's salary in half and then throw half the staff overboard. <laughs> Mr. LeBonge would say, give the captain some more time. <laughs> and I stand before you committed to taking the wheel and turning this ship around. Yeah! yeah! You have a choice tonight, and you have a voice on March 8th. My name's Stephen Box, and I'd like your vote. Go, Steve! Woo!